marketing. By 1998, I uh, had a prototype that was uh, powerful enough to get a lightweight pilot off the ground. So my wife very generously volunteered to strap into the jetpack six weeks after the birth of a second son. So that was very brave of her. And I had to, to run the engine quite highly stressed. And I'd calculated that we had about four minutes of engine run time before the engine would blow up. So I was more relieved than anything else. This video attracted investors. His hobby, finally a job. By 2008, the jetpack was launched to the public at the Oshkosh Air Show in the US. And it was a hit. Crowd control was needed. The video was seen all around the world. Neil Armstrong sent his congratulations. Even the Pentagon came knocking. It's the jetpack's potential use as an emergency vehicle that's getting major interest. We can get into small places very quickly. Uh, we are tactical, so we're in a, whilst a small radius, we can actually be used and taken on the back of a truck and then passed into the areas where there's a, a need for our capabilities. A micro light license is needed to fly the pack, which can be fueled to stay airborne for 30 minutes. It can also be flown remotely. In you know, five to ten years' time, uh, we wouldn't be surprised if you see the jetpacks flying around on a, on a daily basis. Uh, in some countries, even been used.